Hello, my name is Super Hadley, and I'm doing things a little bit differently. Game Jolt has started their contest, which is the Game Jolt Contest 10. It's where people have a limited amount of time to make games, I think it was like a week or something, to make a game with a theme party. Um, I've been playing all of the games that have entered. It's um, about 670-something people entered, so it's a bit smaller than the Ludum Dare. However, it's going to grow. It's like their 10th one. Um, so I'm going to be playing each game for about a minute each and then have it into a video so yeah I'm gonna begin now next we're playing dance party but with no vowels I'm playing one player so we got different music I think this one's definitely my favorite little Lord boy a bit right. got this all right. Wait, see that fuck. Look at this. This is great. We have to like get our body over there. This is so cool. Oh, perfection. We gotta get our foot up there. Yeah. 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 so weird and hard and fun. You gotta sort of get your body over to it. I can't do it. This is really cool though. Nicely done. Next. Next we're gonna be playing a game called Groove, which is sort of like a multi-ish player game. Um, I think. I don't know. There are no servers! Awesome. Oh, oh, my mouse is frozen because it wants me to allow access, but there's like a game going on. I can't move it. There we go. Let's just allow access to this. I understand there could be so many risks. party which involves friends but I don't I don't have any. So. Alright, so I wanna be blue maybe six HJ. Oh look at this. Blue's got it made. So basically I just press all of the keys. Cause I am all of the players. Um so if you have like a bunch of friends and they all, for some reason, just brought, like, all really wanted to play, um, just say if they all brought a keyboard, but you really only need one keyboard, don't you? If, um, all of your friends would like to try out a keyboard party, here it is. Although I feel like fingers would be hitting each other and it'd be really, really funny, and you'd end up probably killing your best friend because it's always fun to do that. The green player gets like the best noise ever. Oh, blue wins! Woo! I won! So 
Oh, that's a really cool multiplayer game. I love seeing how they work out multiplayer games. Now, if only I loved my friends and had them. Had friends that played games. Anyway, I do love my friends. But they don't play games with me. Anyway, next. Next we're playing Venetian. I've probably butchered that game so bad. Right click to spy. Welcome, my fellow veteran, to the manor of Lord Pur Purpia, and to the most special party. A rush of new business nego negotiations has prompted this gathering. I can't read cursive. And your purpose here is to end it. And them. My employee wishes the bonds between the families of the dukes and the duchesses in attendance to be severed. You will assassinate the Duke and Duchess of Clario Verdiva, in addition to Lord Perpa. When this is done, you'll be paid in full. Oh, I didn't mean to draw my weapon. I thought that was how I talked. Alright, so let's not... I'm guessing these are servants. Oh. Okay, so that'd be really, really quick. I should probably start in very back and then make my way forward. Hmm, kill one person. No one suspects us. So no one saw us. Probably someone important. Got a dog on roast. Anyone important in here? Oh, they found me. This is a really cool game. It's kind of hard though. But I'm guessing that's the point. Anyway, next. Next, we're playing. Um, you can't even imagine how much fun we're having. Three days to go, there's cap cars going on outside. Right. Ooh, I clicked and it scrolled me. This is kind of creepy. We've got some pictures of people that are obviously in pain. I can't, it doesn't lock my mouse in it. It's all falling apart, oh, literally. And it's time to go. I'm trying to get my mouse back into the game. Right. Okay, there's a fire there, so let's go this way. Who set everything on fire? Oh. You guys set everything on fire. Why are you guys setting things on fire? Come on now. Hey man. Hey man, what's going on? It's pretty heights we have here. Can I fall out of the window? Nope. So I'm not sure what to do other than explore, but this seems like quite the place. Looks like we're at an art museum. Anyway, next. Next we're playing Bloody Party. I'm not exactly sure how to play though. So. Hmm. Maybe I should look. Avoid the bloody monsters and put some money to get arrow keys to move. Well, who am I? Oh, this thing. Oh shit, I was eaten. This game is, uh, kind of weird. I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna lie. No, they come up too fast. I like this corner. I don't 
know what that shadow is or what it's doing. That must be what the heart's for. Just wanna bang into them. This game is pretty cool. Anyway, next. Next for playing You Are Nothing, there was an epilepsy warning, so I'm just letting you guys know that they did have a warning in their video, which is really, really nice of them. Oh, this party is so boring, I want to leave. Um, my issue with epilepsy is I love when gamers have a warning, because I don't have epilepsy, but I have friends who have epilepsy, and on top of that, my eyes are really sensitive to flashing colors. I used to stare at the sun and shit. I, my eyes are just really fucked up, and flashing color really hurts them. So, intense flashing color strains my eyes. Okay, this is the biggest party room I've ever been in my life. I want to live here. Damn it house is even bigger. Or maybe we're all just really, really tiny. That could be it. We all could just be really tiny. What's this guy doing? Changing the TV? You want some pancakes? Oh, he's cooking. Hey, where are you going? Away from you, motherfucker. I want to see these flashing lights. In the bathroom. Do I need to wash my hands? Nope. Bathtub. This house is so huge. Nothing. Oh, that's a bit flashing there. That's not too bad though. You are nothing. I feel like shit's about to get real, you know? I don't even know what to say, I'm just getting shocked at the moment. This is probably the most interesting game I've ever seen in my life. Our time is so beyond up, so if you want to continue walking and find out, there's obviously a link to all of these games in the description. So you can check it out. Oh yeah. Next. Next we're playing Super Pre- I can't read this, it's so suck. Super Pretentious Machine. Um, I don't have friends, so I'm gonna play all of these players. So, player 1 is arrow keys, player 2 is WASD, and then you got some joysticks, power-ups, or down, enter to pause, art or fresh, awesome. So we're gonna play two player. Oh, okay. This is adorable. Let's get both of you. How do we do this though? Okay, why don't you jump on top of me? Alright, so let's get this one in. Blue guy wants WASD to be used with him. I'm not good at WASD. That was some nice teamwork. Alright, so what are we doing? Ooh, wow. Oh. Waiting for him to cut through. Oh, now there's two. That's gonna be taken. No, not quite. Alright, beautiful. Oh 
bad. It's kind of nice how you have to do like teamwork to even get to the two player mark. Oh, so it's randomly generated every time. That explains why we couldn't fit. So do you just sort of wait until they uncover some stuff? Stop dying, blue guy. So yeah, this game is pretty cool. I need some friends though to play with me. Anyway, next. Next, we're playing not just any party. You're invited, but this is not just any party. Of course we're in RSVP. Everybody, but who are you? Wait, let's see. I guess I'm him. Go. All right, so I'm at a party. Of course, as WASD instead of arrow keys, so I'm probably gonna die. Well, how do we get up there? Not just anybody, there's no one here. Where are all the peeps? I didn't read. I to play the game ahead of time. Cause I'm the new. Alright, well, let's go read how to play the party. How to play the game. Start off by socializing the party. Go to six foot party. Alright. So I just read the little thing about it. And I don't know, it doesn't do socialize. So let's go socialize. Oh, but I can't, there's no one here. I don't know. I don't know. It's still in development, so I'm guessing more will come. But I just, I don't know. Oh, I can drink alcohol. I don't know. Next. Next we're playing Cats vs. Zombies. It was a normal film. Luna's house is a cat's party, and then it went to suddenly zombies. Alright. So, we got some cards. Domestic cat. Yeah, come on, actually, let's play a card. Let's play a card. Let's play Kelly. How do I? Oh, this one. Tech. No, it says defend. Play card, I have card done. Alright, now there's two zombies. Dag, play card. How do I actually play these cards? I suck at card games. I never understand them. So, it's probably one of the best card games ever, and I just suck at playing it. I can't play a card though. All these cuts and nothing to do with them. Unsure of what to do. Let's play. Card. I want to play this card. I want to play it. I don't know how to play this game, but you should.